E lava peke faianga o ki fa matala ki he ta fa aki ko ia o e nga hi fa nau nau ko nga hi me a nga we ko ha nga hi toko ni na e lava ki fa lelei i pe a o ko wa te pe faianga Maria ma o ki fa pe a ki fa matala mai ki ta fa aki ko ia malo malo o pi to ko e fa lelei na e fa i ko i te te fa le ai na fa fo o ko to a i u o ha e umia nga we ko to a pe i lo to o ma nga we a ki fa le. Hangi ko e pens, hangi ko e sing ni mga ay ang panlilay mo e bathroom, pero e para kau kau fang ay fagtapu, pero mo e toiletti kung ay ang kahit kau mahaki, ko e pero mo e para mo e ato, para fuo e ato, he ko uhi ko e palpale malahin e mau pa mo e, pero time pa uha e mau fagtariba e, mau fagaw ko e mau fagtonya. Kau faham dia sih, awak ni kau yang lama ni ni, ayah ayah suka fuo kau ya, dia dia kau mui kau fuo mui mui aku ni kau hi ke moko moko ni ni, dia lotto kau kau aku mui ke aku sih ayah kau bahagi ayah ni ni, dia mui pe pe fuo aku mana kita nak mui, tapi aku cuma tahu ke kau ngah we, kau hi kau tak mila hi aku kau ye ayah kau kula hi ngah we. Kau kau deh deh ya, nafas fuo kau ya kau ni kaki mau tol ke hui ke mui deh deh pun mau seno. Ya kau ingat umen, lama kau fuah deh deh imai kau yang kau lama kau ke mau siok kau ahon, mau mari fuo kau loki kau to pe loki kau loto, nai kau mui no mari loki mahal kau ingat umen fuo pe ya nai lama kau ke fuah deh deh kau heme malo. Kau fi fi aku pito pe kau fuah malo lah ya tu sista. Tu tanga tovo i he mau fainga Maria ka koe sister pule ni he tafa aki koe ni he fale fa ele, fale mahaki vaiola, ka uke ai amanaki te tau hoko atu ki he tau polo kalama malo au pito e tu tanga i mau fainga Maria. Koe a koe e tu ngai a koe o kui ai ai teu teu atu koe a ki nau tolo pe a mei he fale mahaki vaiola, he tafa aki koe ni he fale fa ele, pe a koe ai amanaki e tataki a te tau e tama a ke tu pou ai o wau ma kehe koe a e pomponini, Kau koi ongong ngofa fifi ya aku pitoi ni kita faangki koi ni oe fale faele koi ni potong awe mauwi ayok mahino foki koi falele koi ni naik kamata mai pe ihe tau ko osio wa umai kihe no fakaka to koi ya ihe ahoni ya aku pitoi pe mui amanaki kihe no tewa to koi ke kose lipine ihe tala fikau lahi leo leo koi ya astele dia kita ngani Aya ko Miss Erin Cleason, tene pagaho ko ato ay ay lea te fito ko yao aho pia mo e kaka ko ifa fi fa lang langia o e o wow makihi ko yao pompong ini o ko amalaki pa kifa ho ko e lea kamata ko yao pompong ini kaka ko e tota haya ko ifa tau kai ko yao polokala ma e aho ko togeta ma ake topo. Ya, koy lo tu ka mata ay tatangki at upay eh faifikaw koy ay po tunga wen mo uwi ay ako faifikaw tanila ta mo uwa di ay ifaho ka taype eh toge ta pule ay ako toge ta ana akaw ola ay lea tali tali di ay ka kakato koy ay ifaho ka plewa ikiminista ay po tunga wen mo uwi ay ako ono po toge ta siyo saya ma upi ukala ay Nga hi fa mata la ko ya ke to unga ni iya ko ya fa le fa ele ko ni a e poto ngawe mo ui ki mo a fa fi wana ki ke to unga lo lo tonga pe a ko e e po ki fo o e ni o ku wa si a ya e ka o ngawe ko ya ta fa an ki ko ni pe a o ku iya a mana ki e fa ho ko a te tau ki i lea ko ya o e pong pong ini ko e impact of the renovation pe ko hono tu ko a te nga hi a we si a ki mo a pe mo e tu unga lolotonga ko yo kui ai ai falele i ko ni ana e fa hoko e he tokoni ko ya e pole ana australia ai ak mahino pe foki ko e tokoni fa pa anga ko ni na e fa hoko ia ke fai a hono falele i ko ia o nga hinga we ko ia ke ta fa aki ko yo fa ia hono toka ngai ki na ki na tol ko si nga fa e ai ak na to tama Dia hangi pekoya kau ngahi fatongi ya mafa tu gitu kita mau pele pele ngesi fahoko kita auto ke kau nesi. Dia aku amanah kiai ke fahoko ay ay 
Whakaawa koe ni pia mohono uh, Luva tu koe ia ai... Mea ofa koe ia ka koe toko ni whapaanga ia e poreanga Australia Whahoko ia ke pato ngā ue uh, mo ui Koe kose koe ari pine Pea moe o wau koe ia Pea mohono tatala koe ia e maka whamanantu koe ia oe ahoni e whahoko pe ia e whawhe whalanglangi ko ia e pompongini ka ko e talawhe ka olahi leo leo ko ia Australia ki tonga ni ko Miss Erin Cleason e whahoko pe foki pe amo e whangi special item e whahoko ato ia ka whahoko whatongia pe ko ia e tawhaaki ko e ni ki he delivery room pe ko e tawhaaki ko ia o e whare wha e lehangi ko e whatapo pe a o ko ia i a e wakai ko e uhi ko e tuunga ko e o ko ia i a e ka o Whahoko whatongia, koe ka o tāki koe ia e ngā hita whaaki, koe ka e uma āwhoki e ka o nesi pūre, nga o whiewhia whataha, ka o whataha i he e ta o whamawhola rea koe ia e ahoni, pēo ko ia i ai wakai koe uhi o ko nga o whofonga whiewhia au pito ka koha whiewhia koe uhi koe e pofo o koe ia koe nga wā o sia i he ahoni. Ka hiri pe koe ni o e ngāhi whari āri e whā hoko antu e he tawha ahki pe koe ni o e whare whā e le e hoko atu ai pe ki he lea whara mālo Aia ko amanaki pe e whā hoko antu e he pule lahi koe ia pe koe CEO A e poto ngā o e mo ui ko toke tā, Reynold o whanoa Pea ka hiri koe ia e kakato ai pe ahono E kakato ai pe ahono A Whā hoko atu koe ni pe koho no tuku atu koe ni o e ngā hi whamawholanga tonu koe ia e ahoni. Whā hoko lewa e whaiwhikao tā nela tā mo ua a e lotu tuku. Ka ko whaiwhikao tā nela tā mo ua, ko e whaiwhikao pe ia e potu ngā ue mo ui. Ko e whaiwhikao ia sia sue siliana ko ia o havelu loto. Te a koe ia koe ai ai wakai ko e hiok mea heni ai e ke menei stā mo ui. A ia ko toke tā... Onopo, toke tā seo saia mao piukala i he pompongini a ia ko i heni ai pe foki i pea mo e pule lahi ko ia e potu ngā ue mo ui a ia ko nga o whawhiloa ki ato i he pompongini ki he whawhi whalangvangi ko ia e pompongini ka hange pe ko ia ko ia e whawelewela ko ia i he pompongini ko e whie whia e ka ko e ka o whahoko whatongia ko ia i he pompongini e wakai ko ia ke kaunesi i he pompongini o ku i ai pe foki e whaika marie i he hiri pe ko ia no whaho ko ate lea te fito ko ia e aho e whailewa a e na o a waka wakai ki loto ki he loki ko ia na e whai aho no whakalelei pea ko ia ko ia e tu ngā ia ma whana ko ia i ai ai ka o whaho ko whatongia ko ia o e pompongini pea me he tawhaaki ko ia ni o e Whare whā e le pe koe Tawha aki koe au whaia hano toka ngai kina o ki nau tō koe si i kau whae Ka tāki koe si i whae si ngai whae ko tō ateo e o tō ngani o ko whaia i ahano toka ngai ki nau tō lo I he taimi koe au ko nau tō tā mai Pea i he taimi tata au pe o ko i ae wakai koe uhi o ko Māu hake ae kau nesi kai o maa ae kau sista Moe ka o tāki peo e ngahi tawhaaki kei kei koe ia pot ngā oe mo ui O ngā o kaufa taha pe i he pompongini I he polokalama whamawhola ngā tonu koe ia e pompongini Ka koe no whaka ilo ngā iwa mo no whaka awa koe ia mo no whoa ki e pole a ngā Australia Ai kokoni koe ia ke pot ngā oe mo ui Hange pe koe ia koe tu unga koe ia koe ia ai Koe ia, koe tu unga ia, koe ia, koe ia, ae, ka o whahoko whatongia, koe ia, o e pompongini, pia mi, he whare maha ki vaiola, i he hauani. Hange pe koe ia, koe hiri pe koe ni whahoko e ngahilea te fito e aho, e hoko atu ai pe ki he whainga māri e koe ia te nau i loto ai, i he loki koe ni, kosi koe ia ripine, pa te nau me ato ki loto. Ko e uhike whaeha wakai ki he tu unga ko ia o ku iai A e whaarelei na e whaahoko ko ia Ka ko e tokoni ia a e poreanga a o seriria i he pompongini Mahino pe foki ange ko e ngā hi whaamatala Ko e whaarelei i koe na e whaahoko he kautaha langa ko ia e puloka construction 
pea oko e ai foke e wakai koe uhi koe to unga koe ia pea moe lau maria koe ia i ai kau nesi pule koe ni i he pompongini me i he whale maaki wai o lau nau fuk maa to aki fie fia au pito pea uai pe foke e wakai koe uhi oko Ok, foki e wakai koe uhi koe tu unga koe uhi aia e a moko moko lelei au pito Ne ongo pea ku haa mai hueloe laa ne hulungia e funga e fonua Ka oku maili moko moka e a pea oku fafofa o pito e angai tue e anke ahoni Pea mi he fale mahaki vaiola i he pongpongini Koe a i he lolotongani wai foki e wakai koe uhi oku o mau hake a e Kau ni si kau mahu fok ya fa falang langi, pe mau ikhik menista, pot ngau mau ui ihe Hawani, pe mau itu ngau kau yang kuiya yang ngai fi fi ya kau yang hello lotong ani, hangi pe kau mau mek mai kiai, ihe itau tonga broadcasting live streaming, kau sista pule kau ni, tafa aki kau ni fale fa ele, ayah kau sista tu tanga dovo. Pea mo ene pa neono oku teka halope ay pa neono ihe pongpongini ka ko ifa hape e nao fie fia ihe pongpongini ya Ka te tau hoko atai peke MC yewe aho peko toke tama ake tupou ni fa tau ke ya toe polokalama we aho ni Tapu ke afio e o tua maf mafio e o tau loto loto nga. Fua tapu be mo e eg ministra mo ui, ona bo tok tasa e biukala. Fua tapu ma kehe ki e eg ting hai komisina. O asio e lia be mo e ne timi. Fua tapu ke e taki nga awe, putu nga awe, tok ta reino o fanoa. Pehe ki e pule o e fere maki vai o la, tok ta anna ka uola. Watapu ya mbo ofa tu kia, ka mba ka u tak ngawe, hono koto wa bepo ngawe. Watapu ya metro ni, ka mba ka u nesi meet wife koto wa bepo, mwe ka u nesi. Kofu watapu watu ke hengahi ka u ngame, ta ulo nuku kere kere eki koe ni he pongpongin. Peka u kore ke uhufanga he tala kakato e fonua mo lotu, Kaya tak mahu mautuan kita tak kira tu epok kalam mahu ni refka Britania. Kau hui kau tahu kaya ngam memuri. Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed guests and esteemed members of the Viola Hospital community, Malo Lele, I am Dr. Marke Tupou, honoured to stand before you as part of the master of ceremony and your head of obstetrics ward. I begin by expressing my profound gratitude to our Heavenly Father for the serene weather. Allowing these significant occasions, we acknowledge divine knowledge, enabling us together on this auspicious day to unveil the, up the upgraded Viola Hospital Labor Ward. Before we proceed, let us come together in prayer I humbly invite Reverend Daniela Tamoua to lead us in an opening prayer. Reverend Tamoua, please join us in seeking blessings and guidance for, his, for this special event. Thank you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, I may read out this passage has been taken from the daily readings for today. It is Psalm 139, verse 13 to 18. It is, of course, a Psalm of David, and it reminds us the omnipotent an omnipresence of God himself. For you created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I am fearfully 
and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in the secret place, when I was woven together in the depths of earth. Your eyes saw my unformed body. All the days ordained for me were written in your book before one of them came to be. How precious to me are your thoughts, O oh God. How vast is the sum of them. Where I, took, I count them, they would outnumber the cranes of sand. When I awake, I am still with you. He ko ko e na ake ngahi hoku kofu wae, na ake lalanga i he fatu o e ku fae, te u whaka fita i ki a te koe. Hono ku o whaka ake i ngei, mo whaka o fo hoku ngahi e, ko ho o ngahi ngawe, ko e koto whaka o fo pe, pe au ku mātu aki ilo ia e hoku lau māri e. Nai kai puri me te koe hoku kano sino i he taimi na e ngahi ai au i he lilo. Na e tāwhaka ingo ingo kita i he ngahi feitu o lolo whonua. Ko hongo whoi whofonga na e sio ki a te au, ko e konga toto pe. Pia na e tuu i ho tohi ko toa pe, a e ngahi me mipa na e hoko hoko ngahi os kua te eki hataha i ai. Pe a hono i kai mahu inga ki a te au ho ngahi whakakau kau, ela e. Ko hono tāna ki hono i kai where where. Ka au ka ahi ahi whatu ia, oku hulu i he one one. Ka au ka ofo hake, isa, oku o kei whi ao mo koe. Amen. E ki ko e o fa a a a Sabaoti, ko e o tua o tonga, io e ko e a Fiona, o ku fe mao mao taki ki ai, ai me a hono koto koto a beo e univers. Ne fou me i ho a fio, o ku tu unga naki ki he a Fiona, pe a e iku ki ho a fio pe, ai me a koto a pe. E ao niu, ke toka i manang, ogo i kai mahakule, fongao e a fiona, whakawhita i atu eiki. Langi langi e fonua maa mani ko toa pe, ogo ke i wiringi ai e fuka, i e ki otu motu si i si, mo ma siwa ko eni, whakawhita i, ko e otu a mo tonga, ko i e ho mau to fia. Lau ma, whatongia, Io, ko e ngahi whatongia ko toa pe, ko hono tūki mua, ko e mau lau, a e mālo ia, o e awhiona. Ke i lāko i whielelei e tamatu i tu po wono, a mā e tahi ne kuini na nas pau, a e tama prinis kalauni ka umā e kaha o tonga, mau whakawhetai e ukei whakalepelepa, 
Wanu kono ka ka uma ho e ke fono e pare mi ka uma e ka nga o e pure ang ma u he kere kere e ke apiko vaiola na e faka ta pui ke faka manatu ke kuanga mo to tangata ko to be o ku ke ta fe to rik ai of ai afiona ma u he pong pong in ke faka ho ko mo faka ka ka to e fa to ngi ko hen i he ni ai to ko ni komisiona Hai komisioner na Australia, tali tali lele he ek minista o e potunga we, si osai ma ufa abe piukal. Ai purenga we, ka ma e toke ta pure api ko vaiola. Ai metroni ka ma foki hono ka nga nga we. Ai va nga we ko eni, ko hono teu teu, ko e nga hi fatongia ke tali tali aki, ai ma i mo ai afiona e api ko vaiola. Ogu kei hoko hoko pe, ai whakatupu mea ai afiona. Whonga ngā hi whae, whanau koe inas mea si hova koe tofia, koe koloha ku ke omi koe fua ho mau ngā hi manau, ei ki whakawhetai atu. Langi maari e aho, e au whakawhofa hono mea koe toha pe, koe uhi pe, koe afiona. I kai maka tuu ngai i hatoe lele, heu i kai moha lele i he moui, Ko ho a fio i ho mau loto lotonga. Ko e toka i maanang, o uke whakataulam, o uke whakalotoa, a ki nau tolu ko toa pe, uo whai e tokoni mo e of, ko e uhi ke haa ma sani pe angi ngilai, ai api ko vai ola. Mau whakawhetai i atu eiki, e ko e toko naki pe ia, ai a fio na. Tahapu aki mai a ho pe a mono anga, e i ko e mau lotu ma uain pe ia, ke ke i mono ia e kere kere api ko vai ola. Ko e holo anga o e nga hi fofonga, Au mai ngā hi kuonga, e kei whakataulama le lei, ai ngā au e kihe mo ui, ko e taha i mea, na e tokanga e kina, e he afiona. A mōne mōre ei ko māuatu e māuwhatongi ane, e tāpua ki mai peke, tāpua ki mai eiki, tāpua ki mai ngā au e kua lavani. A wange ho i fua e whinangalo oe afiona, hoko hoko atu e māuwhaiwhatongi ane, ko hi pe ko hua whaa eiki, ke mano ia, e a mo ui, Ya ke tāpua ki ai a tonga, i huawha e tamahi pa moe alo, e a moe lau māri e māo ni oni, bea ke tau lotu ko toa, o pehe, e māo tamahi e kuhie vain, e tāpua o huawha, e koko mai ho pure, e whai u whinangalo, a nge koe i he langi ke pehe foki i māo maini, o a ke mai a hoa ni a māo mea kai ki hanai, a mōre mōre māo ngahi ana hala, A ngei koe mau whaka mori mori a ki nau tolu fua beng moa mai. E oa nga ke tukwa ki mau tolu ke hai ah. Ma hau ki mau tolu mehe fin. O oa e pure mo e malo. Mo e koloria. O ta e ngata, pe ta e ngata. E meni. E meni. Thank you, Reverend Tamboa, for your inspiring words and blessings as we embark on this remarkable journey. Your presence foster unity and tranquility among us. Now, let us begin by welcoming Dr. Anna Kaula, the medical superintendent, who delivered the welcoming address, setting lights on the occasion significance. Dr. Kaula, please impart your thoughts with us. Tapu pea moe a fio ai ta e haa mai o tau loto lotonga. Tapu moe ki minista mo ui, Dr. Saia, ma o whaa pea piu kala. Tapu moe awhi whakalang langwe a ho, Ms. Erin Cleason, the Deputy Australian High Commissioner to Tonga. Tuk pe moe ke whakamal malo a te whakatapu kakato ni kamata a ki tau polu kalama, kai a taa moe whinimotu ani, ke whakahoko a tu ai whatungia, ni kouna ki a iau e kau fotu tu polu kalama a ho. Honorable Minister for Health, Dr. Saia Maufabea Bukala, Ms. Erin Cleason, Australian Deputy High Commissioner to Tonga, and members of your diplomatic corps, Dr. Reynold Ofanoa, CEO for Health, Reverend Daniela Tamoua, the Viola Hospital Chaplain, let me thank you for the most appropriate scripture this morning. Dr. Ofatukia, and heads of division, heads of sections, senior staff, the Ministry of Health, midwives, ladies and gentlemen. 
Happy New Year, good morning, and welcome to Viola Hospital. Special welcome to Ms. Alison Gao, who is the first Secretary for Health, whom I believe recently arrived in the Kingdom. Welcome to Tonga. Indeed, it is an honor for me to welcome you all to this momentous occasion of the commissioning of the newly established Labor Ward, funded by the generosity of the Australian Government through the Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade. A series of events happened in late half of 2022 and early 2023 with dire outcome prompted us to have a good look at the birthing units in Viola. It wasn't good. <coughs> Something had to be done and urgently. The result is as we are witnessing today. We had to close the labor ward, move it to the cleanest ward in Viola, which is the isolation ward, and set about thinking, how can we refurbish this space? Fortunately, the Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade of the Australian Government, through the Tonga Health Support Services Program, heard our <coughs> woes and were receptive to our proposal for upgrading of the labor ward. We're here to witness the collaborations between our local community and the local community, embodied by the commitment and partnership forged with DFET. The commissioning of this labor ward is not merely the opening of a facility, but the celebration of shared values and commitment to the well-being of mothers <coughs> and newborns. The labor ward is a testament to the power of collaboration where the dreams of healthier communities and safer childbirth have been woven together. The support from DFED is not just financial. It is a beacon of hope, a symbol of solidarity that transcends geographical boundaries. Together, we have created a space where life begins with dignity, where the miracle of childbirth is met with best possible care and compassion. This was not easy work. There were quite a few variations to cater for the need of patients and for those working in this labor ward. Few people are worth mentioning who contributed to this work. Mr. Matani Puloka of Puloka Construction, they were the contractors, Mr. Rocky Fatiaki of Ministry of Infrastructures, who was the supervisor for this work. Ms. Claire Willen of THSSB. Mr. Ben Mayers, formerly of TASP. And Shelley Thompson, the former First Secretary for Health at the Australian High Commissioner's Office. We still have five delivery beds yet to arrive. Our procurement and finance, as well as THSSB and TASP, are working to get these beds to Tonga but unfortunately, there have been delays in shipment. We, however, are making do with what we have been using to date. And as you will witness later, it is time we upgrade this unit. Once again, Honorable Minister, Ms. Gleason, distinguished guests, on behalf of the CEO of Health, I welcome you all to the commissioning of the newly established Labor Ward of Viola Hospital of Art. Thank you, Dr. Anna, for your warm welcome and the emphasis on the importance of the renovation project. Your dedication to healthcare services is commendable, and we are grateful for your leadership. We are honored to have with us today our Honorable Minister for Health, Dr. Sayan Mafa Abea Bukala, who will share with us the impact and significant of this renovation in improving healthcare services for our community in Tonga. Honorable Dr. Piukala, please enlighten us with your valuable insight. Tapki. Hello.
tapuki he afi o tua maf mafi i ho tau loto loto nga pea tapuat ki he CEO o e pot nga oe Dr. Reynold Lofanoa toke da pule for the Mark Viola Dr. Anna Kawola tapuat ki he toke da pule va ko ia ki he Ngahi Fae, we go e Obstetric Ward, Dr. Mark Tupo, Tapat ki he Fathkau, Tapen ki he Metroni, Kau Midwife, Ugmautol ko tawa peku tau Kau Fatahe Pongpongin. Ta kwa e Fatap Makehi hen ki Ngahi Fae, te nao ngawe aki, a e ngawe ko eni ku tau Fakakakatu e Pongpongin, e Leipa Ward, and a special acknowledgement of the Australian Acting High Commissioner to Tonga, Ms. Erin Cleason. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. A warm maloi lele to you all. It is an honor and a great privilege as we gather this morning to mark a significant moment in our healthcare system. The commissioning of the upgraded labor ward represents a noteworthy achievement, and I am honored to share this moment with all of you. This accomplishment has been made possible through the invariable support of DFAT. Highlighting the collaborative spirit that drives positive change in our communities. Today our purpose goes beyond unveiling a renovated physical space. We are here to recognize the profound impact this transformation will have on the health and well-being of our people. Labor Ward holds immense significance. It is the sacred space where new life begins. The miracle of childbirth unfolds, and the health of both mothers and newborn is safeguarded. The renovation of Viola Hospital Labor Ward goes beyond aesthetics. It symbolizes a dedicated commitment to the health and prosperity of our community. What we witness today features state-of-art infrastructure, providing our healthcare professionals with the tools necessary to deliver high-quality care, modernized facilities, advanced medical equipment, and a thoughtfully designed layout contribute to an environment conducive to the physical and emotional well-being of our patients. With the support of DFED, we have expanded, improved the range of services offered in the labor ward, from prenatal care to postnatal support. Our dedicated staff are now better equipped to provide comprehensive and compassionate care to both mothers and newborns. This investment in maternal and child health underscores our commitment to ensuring mothers have access to safe and effective care as well as healthy start for newest member of our community. This renovation goes beyond physical space. It signifies a commitment to capacity building through training, workshops, and knowledge exchange initiative, and this all supported by DFED. So our healthcare professionals have gained new skills, new insights, and in elevating the standard of care provided in our labor ward. This, this investment in human resources is an investment in the future health 
of our communities. As we witness the commissioning of this upgraded facility, let us not, let us not overlook its broader impact on our community. Healthy mothers and newborns contribute to the overall well-being of families. The ripple effect of this project extends beyond the hospital walls, touching the lives of countless individuals and shaping a healthier future for generations to come. I extend my deepest gratitude to Ms. Erin Cleason and the Government of Australia for your unwavering support in bringing this vision into fruition. The renovated labor ward stands as a testament to what can be achieved when communities and international partners join forces to invest in healthcare infrastructure and services. As the Minister of Health, I am filled with pride and optimism as we embark on this new chapter. Together, let us persist in our pursuit of excellence in healthcare, ensuring that every Tongan receive the care and support they rightly deserve. I wish you all the very best with the hope that DFED will continue to support healthcare system in Tonga. Malo Aupito of Alayat. Thank you, Honorable Dr. Bukala, for sharing your insights and highlighting the transformative impact of this renovation. Your visionary leadership in healthcare is instrumental in shaping the future of our healthcare system in Tonga, and we are grateful for your support. We are now, we are also privileged to have with us Ms. Erin Gleason, the Acting Australian High Commissioner for Tonga, who has graciously agreed to deliver keynotes address emphasizing the close relationship between Tonga and Australia in bringing about positive change in healthcare infrastructure. Ms. Gleason, please share your thoughts with us. I'm a bit shorter than the minister. Okay. And less, definitely less intelligent. Does that work? Can you hear me? Great. Good morning, Maloa Lele. Um, thank you so much for having us here and disrupting the important work of the hospital today to mark what is a very happy day and a very happy start to the new year for the Australian Government and our partnership with you all. I want to acknowledge the presence today of the Honourable Minister for Health, Dr Saya Pulakala. I want to acknowledge the presence of CEO, Dr Reynold, uh, Dr Anna, the Medical Superintendent, our Master of Ceremony and Head of Department, Dr Ma'ake, uh, the Chaplain for Ministry of Health, Reverend Daniela, and distinguished guests, particularly the midwives, nurses and doctors who are here today. To those representing other ministries, Ministry of uh, Finance and Infrastructure, and also our construction partners, lovely to see you and thank you for being here today. Uh, this project has been a labour of love for us, and that is an intended pun um, for the Labour Ward. It's, it's so exciting to see it opening here today at the start of this year. This is the first event for the Australian Government's Development Partnership for 2024, and I think it's very apt that we are having it here at Viola Hospital um, in celebration with the Ministry of Health. This is because health really is at the centre of our partnership with the Government of Tonga. It is the largest part of our development partnership and we have a 20-year formal commitment to working to support your priorities and your leadership in the health sector. And as um, Dr Anna said, it's also very apt to be celebrating it today with our 
our new arrival at the Australian High Commission, uh, Alison Gow, who is our first Secretary for Health. This is her first day in the office and her first hour in the office, so very apt that she could celebrate today. So welcome to the Kingdon Alley and welcome to the beautiful uh, Viola Hospital. So as I said, we have a very long-standing commitment uh, to supporting Tonga achieve excellence in healthcare, as uh, Dr. Saya put it. We have the 20-year commitment, but our, our priorities and our um, partnerships go way further back than that, and will go further than that into the future. Every year, we provide around three million top directly into the health system through budget support for health services, that, and those uh, activities are negotiated by both uh, our team and uh, the Ministry of Health. We also have uh, excellent technical advisors, and so nice to see those here today, and, and really broad and long-term partnerships between health institutions in Australia and different departments here at the hospital and across the kingdom. Um, we, but we understand that there's new issues that always arise, and Dr Anna gave a really good understanding of the issues that came up with the Maternity and Labor Ward in 2021-2022 and they were beyond the ability of our direct financing to the Ministry of Health to, to overcome. So last year, Australia provided a very significant one-off budget support payment to the Ministry of Finance of 30 million Australian dollars. And at the direction and leadership of the Prime Minister, the Minister for Health and the Minister of Finance, we agreed that the majority of that funding would go to health needs. The first thing we agreed that that funding would go to would be the refurbishment of this maternity ward. So I want to commend the leadership of the Government of Tonga for recognising that that funding would go foremost to health needs. Also through that funding, we've agreed to buy a new mammogram machine uh, for the hospital to ensure that we can detect earlier the number one cancer affecting Tonga's population. We've also agreed to fund a new nursing ward, uh, sorry, new nursing school at Tonga National University to double the number of um, entrants into the nursing program so we can increase the number of nurses being trained and working to serve the population here. And finally, we've agreed that that funding will also go to contributing to the rebuild of a hospital in Vavatul. So very significant, and once again, to thank the government of Tonga for your leadership and <laughs> prioritisation for those activities. So today is a moment to celebrate our partnership at the highest level between Australia and Tonga, and as Dr Anna said, to celebrate our shared values and shared commitment to healthcare. On a personal note, this is really important to me. I think back to what have been some of the happiest but also scariest days of my life, and that was when I gave birth to my two children. For women, to, to think that women of Tonga have less worries now when they come to give birth at Viola Hospital is something that I'm personally very happy to support and very proud of our work. Um, and I'm sure the mothers in the room here know exactly what I'm talking about when I'm thinking of the fear and the happiness and the love you feel when you're in those maternal wards and um, the miracle of childbirth and how important it is that we make sure that women and their families feel comfortable and safe when delivering the next generation. So I'm just really excited that this has happened um, and we're seeing the hard work of many people um, today. I want to thank everyone involved in these efforts, and Dr Anna ran through a lot of them, so I'm sorry to repeat them, but first to thank my colleagues at the Australian High Commission and the Australian Health Program for your commitment. I want to expect the dedic sorry, I wanted to highlight the special um, commitment that one of my staff members has had to this project, uh, Latu Fusamalohi, who not only was so committed to this project that she fell pregnant after we announced we were uh, going to refurbish the maternity ward, but she has been so committed that she has held off delivering her child, who is due next week, <laughs> until the labour ward was finished, that she could test and quality assure uh, the project. So thank you, Latu, and best wishes for the delivery of your next baby in the next couple of weeks. Please look after her midwives, as I know you were. I know you will. Uh, to Claire Whalen and the former procurement advisor Jody Clark, who worked really hard on making this happen in a, in a short amount of time. To Paloka Constructions for working in such a collaborative and speedy way. 
uh, to, to get this over the line. To the Ministry of Finance and the procurement team and the aid coordination division for again supporting and agreeing that this would be a priority for our budget support. Thank you to the Ministry for Infrastructure for your oversight. To the Ministry of Health staff, um, we know how hard you work and we really value the work you do. We w this is not just about patients today, about patients feeling that they're safe and supported, but also to ensure that you feel safe and supported and comfortable when you come to work and when you work in the labour ward. So today's about celebrating and recognising you and ensuring your wellbeing. To Dr Adela and Dr Reynold, of course, um, thank you for your ongoing leadership and collaboration. We always enjoy working with you and supporting um, everything that you do for the, co the country and communities. And finally, of course, to thank the Minister for Health, who just informed me that this might be his last formal engagement in his role before he takes up his new role as a Regional Director for the World Health Organisation for this region. It's a really bittersweet moment for us, and I'm sure for the whole of Tonga, uh, to, to thank you and to, to say a little goodbye. Um, we will miss you from in Tonga, and just to say thank you for your leadership your, uh, your clear vision, your commitment, um, your grace and good humour has been a real privilege to work with you in the last year. Um, but we're so happy that you're moving on to bigger and better things in that role with the World Health Organisation. And I know you'll achieve great things for the Pacific and for Tonga and Australia in that role. So we wish you the best of luck and I hope to see you back in Tonga for a trip soon. Um, and again, just to say thank you so much for letting Australia be, be working hand in hand with you at Viola Hospital and with the Ministry of Health. Um, the Minister ended by saying he hopes DFAT will continue our support, and of course he knows we will. But just to say, you know, health, <laughs> health is really at the centre of what we do in our partnership, and we won't be moving away from that anytime soon. Thank you all for your work, and Malo Pitto and Offa Atu. Now we have come to the fun part of the program for today. But I would like to thank Ms. Cleason for your inspiring words and for reaffirming the commitment to collaboration between Tonga and Australia in healthcare development. Now, as I am the master of ceremony, I'm allowed to ask something of you. So please, after the memogram and the new nursing school and the new hospital of Avau, we are in desperate need for a gynecological ward. That's our number one priority needs <laughs> for, for Viola. We, we, this facility, Ms. Cleason, will greatly enhance our ability to provide comprehensive care for women and address the unique health care needs they face. We sincerely hope that this project aligns with your vision of fostering future, healthier future for the people of Tonga and corporations. Thank you very much for accepting our plea for you for today. Now, if you look at the program, we have about a short time to do rip and cutting and a short tour of the newly upgraded facility before we finish our program. Uh, Honorable Minister and Mrs. Gleason, please, can you come to this site. Hi, I'm going to go to the house. 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 Aya koe wakai koe ni ihe hawani koe kosi ene li pine koe ya kihe fale fa ele aya fa hoko pe ya ehe talafika ulahi le ole oko ya pole anga australia pe ya oku pe ya oku mui mui an toi pe kia i pe ya moe toge ta pole koe ya ta faaki koe ni kihe fale fa ele ko toge ta maake tupou.
Aya ko e tuo ngai ko yo ko iya ihe lolotongani aya mahi no pe foki ihe hawani ya pe pe mo e to eta pule ko ni fakato e fale mak vaiola ko to eta ana akau ola aya oku nau fa ho ko hana e nau ta fakato itu ape ni te ge ge nau me a tu kiloto ke fa ho ko ko ya ai makai ko ni ge ngai loki ko ya ko fakalele i Io ko e fia fia ia ka ko a fia fia ai ka o ne si pule ka o mai ka o metuloni ka e pehe foka te ngau tol ko to a peko e ka o ne si o ku na o mui mui a tu pe i tu a e e ki minista ko ia pot ngau mo o i ka o ma a foki e talafe ka o lahi ko ne a talafe ka o lahi le o le o ko ia a steleria ki tonga ni. Aya ko e wakaya ihe hawani ko ya na o me atu kiloto. Aya ko e wakai ko ya ihe lolotongani. Aya ko e wakai ko ya ihe hawani ko e tu ngano ko e ko ne makaflamana tu. Iyo ko e fafo ofa opito. Hanya pego yang mau mek amai ihe tau live streaming Ayah koe Taha fokin yang ahi loki na e fralele i Pea oku Mahino pe ae tu unga koe aku iai ko Iai yang ahi fralele i lah iau pito iya Ihe bakai koe iya ihe pompong ini Ihe tapa ahki koe ni Ayah koe Loki ko iya ko payai aho no toka ngai kina o kina o toko si ngai faek na o to utama. Aya ko e wakaya ihe pompong ini. Kwa fo o fa upito ae. Kwa fo o fa upito ae wakai ko iya ihe hawani. Ae ngahi loki ko ini ko fai hono fa lelei i Mari pe hangi pe ko ia ko e loki ko ini teu teu ko ke te ngau tol ko ke si ngai fa e Pe ko e prepare room Aia o ko Pumatu a ki faf ofa pito e bakai ko ia I he lolo tonga ni ki he ngai fa lelei i ko ia ko fai E he puloka construction ka ko e toko ni ko ia pole anga asleri ia Hangi pe ko ni mo me amai ki ai na kawai a hono falele i ko ni ta faaki ko ni kia air condition aya ko e ma upe e he kau ma upe e he kau fae ai si inga hi fae ko to ape na ulama mai ha mo ko mo ko fe unga ta to te fito ko ni ki he to unga ko ni ku ai ea ai afu Kae uma a foki e wakai koe ni ki he e tau delivery room pego loki koe o faya no toka ngai ki na makehe koe o ki nau tolo Koe si inga hi fa e i he lolo tonga ni o ko mahino pe a e Wakai koe a i he pompongi ni ki he minista mo ui kae uma a foki a e kao toge ta pule Mogi nau tol pe koe kau fa hofa tongia o nau kau fa taha i he fie fia he e boki fo o koe a ko fa hoko pe a mono fa ilonga i koe a i he a hauni Pe a koe a o ko i a i foki a e makai koe Ngahi loki ko toa ko ia nei fai a hono fa lele i pe a mono fa nau nau fo o Aia ko me a ki aia e talak fe kau lahi leo leo ko ia pule anga a Australia Tonga ni pe a ok nau fa hoko pe e nau talanoa I loto i he loki ko ia fai ai 
ai toka nga make he ko ni toka nga ki na make he ko ye si nga hi fa e koto ape na to tama hange pe ko mo me make ai fa le le a to pe ai ta nga hi hi ba a guai pe fo mo live pe ni tu a ko ni u lo lo to nga fa le le a fi lo a to i he Aya ko e wakai a ihe hawani. Lai pe ni ni tu a ihe o tu ngau e mo ui lolo tonga ko ia ko ke ilo to pe po ki e ki nau tolo e nau me a ko ko ia ki loto pa e wakai ki ngai fa lele i ko ia ko lava. Ko e tari tari pe ni tu a ke nau. Me a mai ke hoko atu pe a mo e kolo kalama ma ke koia e ahoni. Ka koia i te tau kolose ke tau live band koia pe a mo e potu ngau e mo ui i he pongpongini. Koya koe. Hangi pe koya mo me amai kia i koe lava kaka to ia ai. Pai koya wakai ki he to unga koya koya i he lolo tonga ni ai tapa aki koe ni ke tau delivery room pe koe tau. Tak faham kau ya, pegawai nu falile ikut ya. Tak faham kau ni loki falile falile, hanya pegawai faham tapu. Ayah aku, ia bakai kau hiku nau. Biar bagi tu aku kau hiku kakak tu ia ngahi. Bakai kau ya kiri ngah. Tu unga kau ya kuiai air. Ngah falile kau ya kau faham aku. Kau ya toko ni kau ya pule anga Australia ke potong awe mui. Ayah ih lolo tonga ni ya. Hanya pegawai mau biar mereka maka kau ini aku tu kau tu kau bayar hospital lepa ward. Kau kau yang nau foki mai tak tahu foki mai kau no no fo anga. Eh ho kau tu biar mau polok lama mak eh kau ya oh eh ahoni. Ayah kau eh special items eh fa ho kau tu peya eh kau fa fatongi ya kau ya potong awen mau ui. Eh lolo tonga ni ya. Kau kau tak faham kau kau ya ay lepa and delivery room eh potong awen mau ui. Paho ko tayo na special item ko yaya ihe ahoni, yaya ko yaya yung kahili pa ko yaya ko yaya ho ko at ay pa kihe tahay nga hi lea fra malo ay ay fra ho ko at uya e togeta ana akaola kaya tita ho ko at upa mo togeta maaketupo. Thank you all. After that short tour of the facility, I can see. Uh, Ladu's uh, face has been reassured 
This is, is going to be well cared for. Now, we have a special item prepared for you all. The obstetrics and gynecology staff will present a performance at our Olunga that honors the hard work and the dedication they put into our caring for women in our community. Let us take a moment to appreciate their commitment and abroad their efforts. Thank you. Thank you, the staff of uh, obstetrics and gynecology, for the heartfelt and captivating performance. Your dedication to providing compassionate care to women in our community is truly admirable. As we near the end of this exceptional event, 
I would like to invite Dr. Reno of Anoa, the CEO for Health, to deliver a vote of thanks, expressing our gratitude to all those who have made this project a resounding success. Dr. of Anoa, please join us and extend our appreciation to the individuals and organizations involved in this achievement. Tapogihe Otua Math Mafi Koe Arifa Moe Omeka Koe Hautoka Oe Universi Tapogihe Kerekere Eike Apiko Vaiola Yako Korea Tge Hufanga Tuhe Talamalu Kakato E Fonua Moe Lotu Kata mo oke fainga mali e koini kono faka kato e fatongia faka malo oyo wa we pong pongin yono fa fofonga ya tu eki minister e mo ui honourable doctor saya mau piukala pako kore peke u hoko atu ihe lea fa piritania. Matu unga, yotau kai nga muli, yotau lo nuku ye hafangani. I would like to acknowledge the presence of the Almighty God here in our midst. The acting High Commissioner of Australia to Tonga, Erin Gleeson. Honorable Dr. Saya Maupiukala, the Minister of Health, Medical Superintendent Dr. Anna Kaugola, and our Master of Ceremony, Dr. Marge Tupo, who is the Obstetrics and Gynecology Specialist for the Ministry of Health and Head of Department. Head of uh, Public Health Division, Dr. Ofatu Kia, Director of Corporate Services, Ope Kupu Matron, and uh, Midwives and Nurses of Viola Hospital, and all the staff of uh, the Ministry of Health who are present here today, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a great honor, and I'm deeply humbled this morning to deliver the word of thanks representing the Minister of Health this morning. Firstly, thank God for making our dreams a reality and giving us a beautiful day and a beautiful event that we have all witnessed this morning. And we thank him for his grace that has made our plans and dreams a reality. I would like to uh, convey our most sincere appreciation to Your Excellency, Erin Gleeson, Acting High Commissioner of Tonga, representing our sincere appreciation for the love and the kind-heartedness of the people of Australia that have generously donated funding to make this project successful. I understand it's not because of us, but because of your love 
for the pure unborn children and our mothers who have been carrying these babies for nine months and it shows your special attention and respect for them and our people. Giving them a head start in life by providing a safe environment for them to be born to and a safe environment to our staff to be able to operate. Honorable Minister for Health, thank you for taking time from your busy schedule to be able to also grace this event and we thank you for your leadership. We thank you for your commitment and dedication, not only to your staff, but for the people of Tonga, ensuring that processes are in place and the people enjoy a healthy life. And we convey our most sincere appreciation to government, especially the uh, Ministry of Infrastructure and Ministry of Finance for their support and facilitating the process to make this project happen. Medical Superintendent, Dr. Anna Akwaola, I don't have the right words. To show the Minister's appreciation for all your hard work and commitment. We have witnessed the opening of another project yesterday and today we thank you for your dedication and doing the hard work on the ground with your staff to provide oversight on a day-to-day -day basis to ensure that the staff of the Ministry of Health are supported with the proper environment, safe and secure for them to provide the high standard services that they normally provide. Dr. Mark Etupo, the head of obstetrics and gynecology, I would like to thank you for improvising uh, the services that you provide to our mothers and our newborn babies in this uh, transitional uh, period in the services that you provide. The rest of the staff of the Ministry of Health commend your hard work and support for the services of the Ministry of Health. And also I would like to commend the excellent uh, construction that we have all witnessed today provided by the Puloka construction. Reverend Daniela Tamoua, thank you for your prayers and we ask that you continue to uplift the Ministry of Health and the services that our people in the ministry are providing because we continue to need godly intervention and guidance with strength to provide our services. Honorable Minister, I understand this will be the uh, last official engagement with the uh, Ministry of Health. We've, we thank God for the years of services and the opportunity to be able to work with our staff under your leadership. We commend your visionary insights and dedication to the people of Tonga. You'll be traveling to WHO, not only representing uh, Tonga, but the rest of the uh, Pacific region, and we have confidence that you will uh, deliver excellent uh, services for our region and their lives.
ya pehe ke tau fono nga pon nga we mo we ke ka una o fa malo wa te fa nga malien to alfa malo thank you dr fanoa for your words of gratitude and appreciation we are deeply grateful to all the individuals organizations and stakeholders who have contributed to the success of this project your dedication and support and leadership have made this achievement possible before we conclude i would like to invite reverend daniela damoua once again to lead us in a closing prayer reverend damoua please guide us in offering our thanks and seeking blessings for future Kama tonga tu nga we mo Kolo te whakangoruna Tu ki e e i ti ma u pete Me pong pong ki e lo tu o malu Amen. 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 Thank you, Reverend Tamoua, for your grace and um, leading our grace today. May the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. Malo Abito. Koe lava kaka to ya a hono foaki pe amo hono flava ko ya a e tafaaki ko ni ki he fale fa ele pe ko e ngai to ko ni ya na e fa ho ko ya pule anga Australia ke poto nga we moui. Koe kaka to ya a hono fa ho ko ato oe o wau maki ko ya oe hawani aya o ko ia ia fifi lahi a pito a kina utol ko to a pika ka fa ho fa to ngia mi he ta fa aki ko ni ko ui ko ngahi fa le lei o ngahi nau nau ka o maa fungi hono ngahi me a ngawe o ku lava ke nau ngawe aki Tak mohon lupa awak ngaji kau ya ketik nau tol kau tu api kau singa hifa e kau nau to utama beku faya nau toka toka ngaji kina kau yaki nau tol kau tu api kau singa hifa e kau kau ya hange beku yaku mau me amai kiai kau lava kaka tu ya ai fama fola le hanga tono kau ya ahoni fa fufonga ya tepe kau fa hoko fatungi ya kau ya pompongi ni mehe Pautu ngawe mo ui, fale maha ki vayola, aya ko e meitafa aki ko e televizion e tonga, kui a vidiami po uli, te foke tukua fute u mohenga, ko fineasi tonga, ka o maafo ki a vaimoana moli, ko e leti o, ko uyai a sosai a maufa apea lolohea, ko a halafoe koloi malo apita mo mea maika mo mea.